congratulations, Milos. Um, were you happy with your performance today? Um, I'm happy with certain aspects of it. Most, most importantly, I was able to get through and get a win. Um, it's a little bit tough coming in after only flying in yesterday. Um, but at the same time, I'm happy with how I managed with the whole situation. How did the conditions differ in uh, Tokyo? Um, just the balls are a little bit different. They fly a little bit more. Courts uh, about the same, but it's just about getting used to the whole new conditions. And uh, you sort of create a routine there after one week, and here you got to find a new one. Physically, after a tough week in Japan, and it's coming towards the end of the tough season, how are you feeling? I'm oh, feeling good. Uh, feeling most importantly healthy, and then uh, just really understanding. There's uh, three more tournaments left this year for me. Hopefully, four and got to put it out there every single match all I can. Sure, obviously you had a good week in Japan. Um, just tell us what kind of confidence that gives you and um, you know, do you feel that you're ready to sort of make sort of further steps up the world rankings? Yeah, no, for sure. Uh, it's, it's really helpful uh, after a week like that. It gives you a lot of beliefs and it just makes the next matches a lot easier. Even through tough moments, uh, you sort of find the solutions a little bit easier with that confidence. And, it just gives me a lot of opportunity and a lot of belief into the next tournaments of things I can reach and uh, sort of push myself to do even better. Well, that was a good week overall. Do you feel a bit disappointed it didn't quite go the extra extra way and win the title? Yeah, of course. It's it's a big difference being just uh, losing the final than winning the title. And that definitely is disappointing, but at the same time, um, I had to forget it quite quickly, which was pretty good, and sort of come here and start all over again. And how are you feeling towards the end of the season? Do you feel you can make the top 10 or, or what are your sort of targets coming up? No, oh, it's been since the beginning of this year to sort of uh, be inside the top 10, trying to push if I can, hopefully for London. It's a lot of things, a lot of uh, possibilities, but I just got to keep pushing, taking it match by match and trying to win as much as I can. And the next match is against Baghdad, this should be a tough one. Yeah, for sure. Oh. I've played him twice. Twice I think it's been 7-5 in the third, so it's, it's not easy playing him. So oh. I look forward to it and I know I'm going to have a challenge set up in front of me.